Good Thursday morning. It is 646. You know about Katia and we also have Maria on the Atlantic. Neither are going to affect our weather directly. We have been watching what's happening in the southern Gulf of Mexico. Talked about this yesterday and it was deemed a tropical storm and it is named Nate. It is moving east at one mile per hour, but it is kind of rotating around an axis, meaning that it's probably going to bobble a little while in one place and then it'll at some point move to the west. It may move differently from what the path here is that is suggested by the hurricane center so we're going to keep a close eye on it as we go through the next couple of days i would love for this system to go a little bit further north and then hook to the west and uh, possibly give us a chance for rain into early next week you can see monday there and then possibly a tuesday landfall Oh, a little bit, a uh, little bit further north, please. 71 degrees outside. I've been watching to see what has been happening around the area. Wanted to also uh, show you what it looks like. San Marcos, uh, live from the Chuck Nash Chuck Chevy Buick GMC dealership down there. Beautiful orange glow. Sadly, probably because of a lot of the smoke that is in the atmosphere, the particulates tend to uh, filter the light out to a point where it looks pretty, but we know what it is. So if you're going to be heading out, make sure that you watch out for the smoke that's out there. 71 degrees. Winds out of the north at seven. Humidity at 20. Percent. Our temperatures, 60s and 70s, then a 54 out in Fredericksburg, a little cooler out that way. 60s and 70s through most of the state and a little bit warmer in some spots. But again, it is looking a little more like September. May feel a little bit less like September in the afternoons, though, and especially in the next week as temperatures go from the mid-90s to the upper 90s and possibly 100s once again. Now, if we were to get Nate to move a little further north, maybe give us some cloud cover and a few showers, those hundreds are not as likely. That would be Monday and Tuesday. We'll show you in our seven-day forecast. A little bit of cloud cover. Concern is going to be for the smoke this morning. That's an asthma. It's a respiratory. It's an emphysema issue. You know and you would likely know if uh, you have that issue to watch out for it. But for little ones, watch out. As we go through the day, the winds are going to pick up a little bit and that'll help filter it out a little bit. Not any rain in the forecast over the next couple of days. That's why I'm hoping Nate will do something for us. 95 for the high today, tonight, running about 60 for the overnight low. And then our forecast in the seven days ahead, we'll see the temperatures go up just a little bit. 95s today and tomorrow, 96 on Saturday, morning lows, 60s. Then for Sunday and Monday, upper 90s, and then 100s for Tuesday and Wednesday. Of course, that would change if the path for Nate does. We'll keep you up